What's good, family? It's me, Game Boy, and we back again with a new video. Today, we're going to be talking about fasting. Um, more specifically, why, why to fast and how to fast. Okay, first, why do you want to fast? You want to fast because fasting is good for you on a physical level and a spiritual level as well. Starting with how it's good for you on a physical level, fasting um starts it, it starts a cellular repair process in your body it you know what i'm saying it makes your body like repair itself on a cellular level also it changes hormone levels in your body to make it easier to burn stored fat like you're gonna be when you fast you burn a lot of a lot of excess fat it's, it cleans out your body like completely you know what i'm saying also um is they say that it can help prevent a number of diseases um and possibly even live longer also i know on a personal level that when i fast i feel lighter you know what i'm saying like and i like feeling i like feeling light you lighter it definitely fasting definitely definitely puts you on like a higher vibration if you understand what i mean by that um also, fasting enhances meditation and yoga. I can say that for a fact from personal experience. On the spiritual side, fasting helps bring us closer to the creator and it exercises self-control. From a Muslim perspective, if you're able to give up things that you need, which is food and fasting, it makes it easier to give up things that you don't need that aren't good for you. Um... You know, because it just, again, it helps, it helps exercise that self-control. And from a Buddhist perspective, um, if you fat after you, okay, so while you fasting, you're going to be focused on like the misery of not eating. But after you stop focusing on the misery of not eating, like after you just like be okay with it and, you know, just cool, like. You quiet that part of your mind. You quiet a very human part of your mind, I, I guess I should say. And by doing that, you open yourself to higher thoughts and insight. So again, on a spiritual level, fasting is, is it's up there. Not to mention you always feel accomplished after completing the fast because it's not an easy feat to complete. So you always feel like accomplished, you know, after you after you complete now that we know why fasting is good, we could talk about how to fast. Basically, there's two main methods of fasting. Uh, you got water fasting, which is where you drink. The, the only thing you consume is water for the duration of the fast. Or they got intermittent fasting, which is when you fast for 20 hours a day. And you eat only during a four-hour window. Um, of the two, water water fasting gets your body into the state. Into water fasting makes you see those benefits that we talked about earlier. You see them faster, like with water fasting. After about forty-eight hours, you start seeing the benefits. Um. Intermittent fasting is only beneficial if you practice it for 30 days or more. I personally enjoy water fasting because, again, it's just quicker. After about 48 days, you start seeing those benefits we talked about earlier. Um, and intermittent fasting, like, is good, but 30 days, um, you gotta like, you gotta be tight on it. But it's good if you like don't really want to give up the food. Like, you can still eat food. While you intermittent fasting. Um, I would recommend fasting if you like, you know, feeling weightless. If you don't like feeling heavy. Um, if you know how you feel like when you eat like heavy meat, you know what I'm saying? Like fast and make you feel lighter. So I would recommend fasting if you like want to feel lighter or if you feel bloated, you know what I'm saying? fast and helps you feel lighter also if you acknowledge that you have a bad habit 
that you wish to stop, a good fast could definitely put you in the right mindset to stop whatever bad habit you may have, you know? Um, again, if you can give up something that you need, then you could give up something that's not good for you, that's, you know, that you don't really want. Also, for spiritual growth, again, fasting enhances meditation and yoga. Um, if you if you need a fresh start or if you just want to clear, clear, clear out your energy field, because again, fasting cleans you out on a physical and a spiritual level completely. So with that being said, like this video, if you like fasting and you like spirituality, comment why you fast. I want to know. Um, and with that being said, thanks for tuning in. Have a good one. Peace.